give thanks in faith psalm 52 and verse 8 but i am like a green olive tree in the house of god i trust in the mercy of god forever and ever this is a declaration of david and in psalm 52 when david says this uh, he's actually not in a good place you know it's a, a time when uh, uh, one of the men of saul found where david was hiding and this meant that saul could track him down any time and that david might even lose his life and david was aware uh, that now saul had information uh, of his position and yet what does david say in thankfulness of heart in trust he says but i am like a green olive tree in the house of god i trust in the mercy of god forever and ever he is thankful for the goodness of god he is trusting uh, in the faithfulness of god even in his troubled times uh, even when he's uh, running away from saul and and you know he he's having to do all these things to save his life he's still expressing his thankfulness and his trust in god you know that is a, a wonderful testimony from david now, what about abraham you know abraham uh, had a long journey as well and his journey was that of faith waiting patiently for the promise of god to be fulfilled uh, for isaac to be born and even 25 years 25 long years he had to wait but this is the confession of abraham in romans 4:20 we read he did not waver at the promise of god through unbelief but was strengthened in faith giving glory to god how is it even possible to uh, express our confidence and our thanksgiving before uh, we see god's promise fulfilled you know it's really difficult but as we walk with god as we build our faith uh, as we uh, come to know god in a deeper manner you know this is possible we can express our thanksgiving by faith for what god is about to do uh, the promise of god which is going to be fulfilled in our lives and we can be a uh, thankful today for what god is going to do tomorrow because we know in our spirits that it is a done deal that god has already come through and in the natural that things will line up and things will uh, begin to materialize because the word of god has gone forth and that it will accomplish everything that god has promised so we can be thankful even when you know, certain things are not completed in our lives and how do we do this we are thankful by faith by faith we praise and worship god let's pray together heavenly father like david and like abraham father we ask for that spiritual strength god that as we wait on your promises lord as we see through our spiritual eyes lord uh, your breakthroughs god that today we can thank you god for what you are about to release in our lives tomorrow father we worship you lord for doing it in jesus name we pray amen thank you for tuning in to living supernaturally For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.